Hello everybody, this is Rob Bobberty here with Five Nights at Freddy's. Now, I saw this game on a Markiplier's channel, actually, and I was, read the description before I watched the video, and he pretty much dared people to play it. And then I saw the full version of it was on Desura for uh, 250 so I had to try it. And I've already played the demo to make sure it worked okay on my computer, and it is kind of freaky. And we will see how it goes in the full version. I'm probably going to... Since it's five nights, I'll probably make five videos, unless some of them are shorter. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Help. Help wanted. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to work the night shift. Uh, not responsible for in injury dismemberment. That's the most important part of that, I think. Okay. Now, the premise is that you're a security guard who just started in this creepy little uh, kid's party place and there's going to be a message left from this guy calling which will give a kind of an overview of what's going on let him talk hello 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 uh i wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night um i actually worked in that office before you i'm finishing up my last week now as a matter of fact so i know it can be a bit overwhelming but i'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. Uh, it's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or a person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing, those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. Yeah. It's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wired, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth that pop out the front of the mask. <laughs> yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day should be a breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. Well, this sounds like a lovely job. I, uh, there's a lot of things strange about that. <laughs> The fact that our power barely lasts the night. We're at 77% power already. And if we go down to this little arrow thing at the bottom, it pops up the cameras, and you can see there's supposed to be three characters here. So already one is out and about moving. And you never see them moving. You always just see them, well, if they get to you, you see them moving. But you never see them moving in the cameras. So you can click these different cameras to see. Now there's the one guy. The bunny, it looks like. And you have to switch through these cameras. This one's just uh, 
little storage area. Oh, backstage. Private Pirate Cove. I think there are actually four animatronic characters, and one of them is in here. But you can kind of see this these camera these camera layouts kind of show you uh, kind of matches you know the map layout. You know, there's you at the bottom in the middle, and you need to check these cameras all periodically. I don't understand this one. There's no camera, just audio, so I don't know if something plays through there at some point. But it's good. you have to kind of check these all periodically, but if you if you sit here using the cameras constantly, your batter, the battery will go down. So this guy's probably not out, as long as you check him every once in a while. I think he doesn't come out. And that guy's there, and that guy's there, and so you kind of have to go back and not do anything because our power is down to 60% which for the first night you know the first night goes pretty easily I just I only played the first night I assume it gets a lot harder and then when you uh, look to your left and right you got a door on each side and there's a light you can hit you can turn that on and off but uh, again everything you do uses more power and if you run out of power you die <laughs> and there's a door on each side, but it uses uses more power to hold the door shut for some reason. So if uh, something's coming to get you, you can you can block them out, but you can't leave them shut because it'll just drain the the power too much. So I'm gonna check on these guys again. Just still the two. He's not there anymore. Uh, is he there? Oh, there he is. He's in the backstage there. Up, oh, and uh, that's not good. All the cameras are out. Oh, wait, they're back. Okay, where do you go? Oh, there he is. He's coming down the hallway. That's not good. Where's Pirate Cove? Which one's Pirate Cove? There it is. Okay. He is coming down the hallway. Coming to see me. Don't think he's singing me a song. But you gotta kinda. There's a lot of waiting in this game, but it's not real long. And I think the, uh, it starts off kind of slow. Uh-oh, there's only two now. Or th there's two out now. Oh, okay, he's coming down the hallway towards me slowly. But I gotta find the bird. Or the bird? Yeah, the bird. It's that one. And this guy doesn't seem to move much. I don't think I saw him move at all. Uh, let's see. The first time I played it, I didn't quite realize how fast the battery would go, and then I was just kind of playing around with it, so I ended up dying because I killed the battery on everything. He's still there. Bird's still there. That guy's not anywhere. Okay. You kind of A lot of times you have to kind of just turn everything off and just wait. Wait for a little bit. And up in the upper right has the time and the, and the night. I noticed that they seem to definitely move when the time changes, so if the time changes, you, you definitely want to make sure you check everything. See, like, this guy's gone. He's coming down. Now he's coming. Oh, no, he's not. Wait, where is he? Wait a minute. Ah! Jesus! <laughs> Apparently I waited a little too long to check that. <laughs> okay. And I think that's me. There's my eyeball sticking out the top there. And I think you can see my teeth sticking out inside the mouth. That was that was fun. That genuinely surprised me. <laughs> I think I was a little too confident thinking, Oh, I'd already played the first night. That's easy. But I got a little too cocky and left it sitting too long. Okay, so let's start. Oh, I, oh, I should have continued. Um, you got to check the the doorways there every once in a while, especially if you lose track of one of them. Okay, here we are back again. And I probably should have hit continue. It might not have played everything. Okay, let's check the cameras real quick. All three are there. That guy's not coming out. Okay. Now, this message is going to play the same thing. And thankfully they give us a mute call so we don't have to hear everything again if you need to hear it you can always rewind the video so I'm just gonna wait a little bit not use up any power and the power does go down 
even if you're not doing anything, if you're not looking at the cameras, not turning anything on, it does start to go down. See, I'm down to 95% already. It goes down con slowly, constantly. It's kind of a weird waiting game because you you don't you don't want to wait too long to do something, but you don't want to use up the battery, so you kind of <laughs> sometimes you're just sitting there waiting, just waiting to go, waiting to check. A lot of crazy stuff in this background here. We've got the poster of the three crazy animatronics. I'm intrigued by this uh, cupcake with a face over to the right of the fan. That's kind of creepy looking. And then the little pictures, kids' pictures, that would be really cute if not for this situation. Okay, let's see. Power coat was clear. Okay, he's all still there. Uh, just run through real quick. Make sure. I think there's only four. You know, actually, I did start the second night. I didn't finish it, but I did start the second night, and I think that's where I saw that the in Pirate Cove there, there's another one, a fourth one. I don't know if there's more later. I imagine there might be more. I hear something. And lots of noises, even if you don't see anything, even if nothing's moved. I imagine at some point... I have to imagine at some point these things are gonna are gonna move on camera to scare the hell out of me. <laughs> okay, still 1 a.m. It goes to 6 a.m. Once you make it to 6 a.m., you're clear. And let's see, Give it a little bit longer, not too long. Actually, it wasn't until like two or three that it actually that they actually started moving. I think, or until they started getting close. So if I sit here till at least two, it'll save a lot of battery and make sure I don't run out towards the end. But it's hard. It's hard not to not to check the camera because you know they're coming. Come on. I hear something. What's that? I wonder if they might come more just because I'm not doing anything too, especially that guy, I think. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Now it's two. <laughs> it's, it's it's hard it's hard to wait. It's kind of it's kind of boring in one in one respect, but I'm sure it it gets a lot more interesting as time goes on. You start to learn how to do things, so it starts throwing more at you. But once it gets you a couple times, it's not as boring <laughs> because then you start worrying about when it's going to show up and. Start thinking, should you check everything again? I wonder if there's something in this one. I'll leave this. I'll leave this on a second. See if we hear anything. <laughs> oh, it's that guy talking. It gets louder when I go to that one. He's he's singing. He's the one singing. It's out of order though. me, it said. It's who? Which one got me? I'm not sure which one got me. I was thinking the bunny was coming towards me, but I don't think it was the bunny that got me. It, I thought I remember it being a hippo. That's the only hippo. I wonder if it's a hippo that's in the pirate cove. Maybe that's the one that got me, because I wasn't watching it at all. You know, that's... I think it's, well, we'll get there, but I think that's what it says at the beginning of the second day. It says that if you don't watch it, he'll come out. If you don't look at it every once in a while. Okay, I'm using up too much battery. <laughs> gotta, gotta conserve, conserve all my battery. Okay. Oh, okay. Buddy is on the move. Let's see, he goes into there, into there, and then shows up in one of these, starts walking down. I think you can't see everything. And I wonder. Oh, wait. Where'd he go? Is he, oh, he's down the hall already. Maybe it was him who got me. I thought it was. Okay, 
he's coming down the hall. You can kind of see him there. Is the bird gone? No, nope, bird's not gone yet. He's still coming down the hall slowly there. He's coming. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> Waiting for you. Is he still? Oh, there he is. Okay, that must be coming down the hall. Ah, uh, I know you're coming. I know you're coming. You're gonna be there any second. I'm afraid to look at the camera. I'm afraid to look at the camera, and then you'll be there. Then someone might show up here. Oh, I heard that. I heard you. Ah! <laughs> Where are you? Ah! <laughs> I'll turn the light off. I don't need to use the light, too. Okay. Okay, block him off for a minute. He'll... I think he'll wander away. Okay, bird's still out there. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, camera's going again. Okay. Okay, he's gone for now. Okay, the bird is on the move. The bird is on the move. Where's, where's the bunny? Where's the bunny? I don't see the bunny. Where's the bunny? I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, there. There's the buddy coming back again. Okay, I think. There's the bird. Okay, he's coming back down again. He's going to try to come say hi again. See, I don't know if uh, this... Coming to this spot, you know, if he's not there, that means he won't be at the door or not. Where's the bird? The bird's still there, okay. Oh, he's getting close again. Bird's not. I'm using up all my battery. I just need to make it a little bit longer, though. Not much longer. Last hour. I hear you. Something flickered there. Maybe we think something... Ah, I heard that. Okay, shoo! We made it to day two! Okay, I think I'm going to stop it here. Um, unless some of them get short, like I said, I will probably make, uh, you know, an episode, a video a night. Okay, so that's the end for now. I'm actually going to... Okay, I'm actually going to stop right here and make another video for night two. This has been Rob Property, and I hope you enjoyed this, and hope... Hopefully I will get the, get the next ones up soon and be able to finish this. And thank you for watching, and I hope you had a good hope you hope you have a good day.